into music like when I was in like primary school or a really young age. I was fascinated by a lot of like alternative shit, insane. Like right now, I'm listening to a lot of local based shit, but also at the same time trying to stray away from like listening to what everyone else is listening to. So I've been listening to people like Dim Lights, Sid Rem, AK, Jodo. Fuck, JPEG Mafia, like a lot of alternative people. Like I, I really, I really f still fox with like some of the old cats, like Vince Staples. When people ask me who I'm listening to, I don't want to be that basic nigga who's just gonna tell you, oh no, I'm listening to Tyler or a Sweatshirt, because that's relative. You can hear that shit in my music. But I like to tell you I listen to other shit that you haven't heard before, and to interest someone into listening to that shit. That's why, like, I don't care what the artist's name is. So long as I get a track and it's like fucking amazing, that's the best feeling to me. And that's kind of like the metaphor I'm trying to play in this like whole industry, being the least important, like making good music, but nobody giving a shit about who you really are, and where you come from, and what the fuck you do. You know? Apart from that, you, you have a great song out. <laughs> but yeah, soon enough, people are gonna get this shit and they're gonna understand why I'm doing this shit. And what it's for. I just want y'all to listen to my shit and understand that, you know, it's just music at the end of the day. My thought process is weird. I like rapping about random shit that no one understands and really gets, but I put it into perspective. Like, I don't just hit you with bubblegum raps and dumb shit. Like, I have some content that you can, like, take away metaphorically if you're really listening to the music. Like, I don't know what more can I say, like, fuck being cool, fuck being relevant, don't, don't conform, don't let them tell you how to fucking do your art, just keep doing your shit and keep pushing your shit regardless of how they might feel, cause like, I mean, what's, what, what's art without you in it, what's, what's, what's creativity without you in it? Oh, so you hate my flow, but those kids in the back screaming they want more. Construction workers fixing the road, lane switch. I'm on the road, tiptoe like G and fathers who bless daughters. That suck dick for show while I be sitting conscious. Shit. I got a new EP coming out soon. It's called Pissed. It's composed of five tracks. A couple, a couple of them have already been on SoundCloud, but I removed my art. Y'all gonna help me go forward into this shit. Like, it's not just money for me to just like do whatever the fuck I wanna do. I'm trying to build. I'm trying to build this music shit, and it's my passion. It's the shit. It's the only thing that I feel that I really wanna do in my fucking life. Apart from that, I'll probably end up selling crack. For real, for real. Like. This is the only thing I really got right now. It's so hard to be acclaimed as an artist. Art is an expression, and I feel like that expression has a sense of freedom within it. Like once you tell an artist how to say things and what to do, it becomes very unartistic. You catch me chilling in the back until further notice I'll probably end up pushing crack until further notice I'll stick to this thing called rap until further notice Yo 
until further notice I've been in hospital beds for overdosing, I'm hopeless Yo, where the rope is, through subliminal messages across the oceans I'm smoking, choking on some potent, I'm no chef, but these chickens get roasted